introduced uh, three uh, boys called Daniel, each one of us. They are brilliant, brilliant boys. They have a project made in the classroom with inputs from their teachers who are wonderful at it. It is dramatic. There is echo about it. It reverberates. We wanted to share it with you now because there are many opportunities. And uh, let's uh, believe in ourselves. Let's be self-confident and let's beat the challenges in our pathway thanks to technology. Thus, they've been able to make it to improve uh, their learning experiences. Daniels, please take over. Molt bé, senyors. Poseu-vos per aquí i endavant. Hola. Hola, buenos días. Somos Daniel. Hi, good morning. Daniel Comina, Daniel Bertrand, Daniel Bordillo. These are our teachers, Roberto Ramos and Victor García, our teachers. We are representing Escuela Rey, a specific school in Guinardó, Barcelona. This is our project. We are up to in our classroom for the last two years. We've been dealing with it. It is called Smart Art. Danny, please tell me how it started. Of course, Danny. Look, Daniel Verdague, myself. We were working on the project of a public hearing set this year on the smart cities and using mobile devices. We come from a special needs school. We wanted to create a sort of platform for smart gardening, a table provided with sensors to control moisture and the interactions needed to keep a properly groomed vegetable garden. We have a vegetable garden in the school that has been provided with QR code systems to identify each crop and introduce extra additional information. This information was user friendly over mobiles and tablets. However, I wanted to go one step further. My first question was whether we could add a sensor on the table of the garden in order to control the distance from from a PC or from any other mobile uh, that enabled internet. Then we met from the Municipal Institute of Informatics, Xavier P. In a session of a public hearing, we were told that our idea was feasible by using computation devices such as Arduino and Raspberry and Scratch software. Scratch is a programming language based on logical blocks fitting amongst themselves into a program. It helped us directly programming the actions we had to control moisture, temperature, and irrigation flows. So, Comic, a company of uh, uh, sand plates uh, helped us in order to keep uh, a source of energy that is both uh, uh, green and renewable. Now it is not connected into the power grid. It works with solar heat. Then you tell them how Scratch works. Yes, at the beginning, we learned uh, how to program animations and games apps classroom agendas used by us, as, and they were shared by other communities. We created them in order to meet the specific needs of some of our fellow students. And the role of mobiles here, for us, they are a critical tool for us to control the garden, and they are used in the classroom. For education, we had some issues sometimes, and we needed help for that. However, little by little, we learned how to properly use them in the classroom. In fact, though they are in our daily business now, we only use them when needed only. So what's next? What's the future of this uh, project? We are in the MS course project. We've started to deal with uh, an exhibition of mobile devices 
We wanted to create an app in order to control the garden table. It is a smart tot app. This is, this is the name for that. Now we are programming it. For us, it is a new challenge. It is cool thinking that you can go somewhere else on vacation and from that place controlling the development of the garden table, watching temperature, moisture, and watching what's going on with the cam in order to properly groom your a garden from a distance. If everything is okay at the end of the year, our app will be translated to other sections of our garden in the school. Our purpose is that some 50 percent of garden tables eventually become a smart uh, garden tables. We as well try to create a web for consultation because we get many demands uh, from people outside Catalonia who want to click in. Let's start working together with the Fabrica del Sol in order to convey our lessons from others working on it. Let's share how we've been helped. Of course, this implies a cooperative and individual work. The project develops in various arenas, technology, creation, maintenance, and assembly. Those who think about it are Daniel Verdaguer, programming the Scratch, and Danny Coma working, dealing with electronics, connections, plugging, and wires. And the others uh, do programming. However, they are the hot brains behind it. Assembly is up to us, together with building. It is a shared with Dan Danny Alba, Jose Gordillo. They uh, are natural to it. Agustin and David groom the table, water, do the harvesting, uh, kill pests. Designing and app creation implies uh, our working together when we started the project. I didn't think we couldn't go this uh, far. The first days were very hard. We were rehearsing with a scratch, uh, and we made a mess of it. It was very hard for us to understand how, what it was little by little. We improved and understood how it worked. Personally, I didn't think we couldn't go that far because of the difficulties we have and how complex it uh, was for us. With the passage of time, we realized that it was feasible. We, co we could make it, as I thought at the beginning. We make it, all of us together, my fellow students, uh, my faculty members, my teachers outside uh, helping us. What apparently seemed a school-based project eventually became something greater. People were keen on it on a smart art app. And they wanted to know more about it. The Smart Art Project was uh, featured on TV. There was media buzz about it. We were asked whether we wanted to have a presentation about it. We took part in some conferences of technology in Catalonia. And we participated in the Science Festival in Barcelona. We eventually got awarded. This encouraged us uh, to get the material for the school to improve our project. Currently, now we try to make you buy it. Buy that the Smart Art project is funny, educational, collaborative, inclusive, entertaining, fun, interesting, dramatic, helping us learn a lot of things. This year, we carry on with it, working hard. There are critical times, difficulties to beat, but we are proud of our achievement. Again, I tell you that we find it difficult difficult. But we've realized that we are very good at other things. Let's uh, uh, capitalize on our talent. Our ideas can mm, be made into a reality. We have no limits on it. So, Danny, please stop off. You know how important it is abiding by time. You are right. Let me top off with my gratitude to all those who had an input into the project with us, the teachers who helped us from other schools who called at us. Thank you very much for your support. The media, 
that circulated our ideas, institutions, organizations that helped us or acknowledged our work, and especially to Imed, Imi, Sokomed, and all the teachers and fellow students of our school behind it. I hope you've liked our presentation, and uh, please try to create a smart art in your schools for other students to learn what we've learned and what technology and collaboration implies in the classroom. We can break barriers with it. Thank you.